anxiety. We all have it within our bodies. We're all super scared of so many different things in our life. We might not really consider, you know, we're not afraid, you know, the ad adrenaline doesn't start pumping and we don't start crying, but anxiety is something that lives within every single person of us. And in terms of getting someone to share your stuff, anxiety really is attached to what will happen to me when uh, I share this. In terms of a 90, anxieties are high in terms of popularity. They don't, they don't know anything. They don't know enough about your shit. So when they want to share something, they need to know that it's safe to share. They need to think that this is the pop, most popular thing around. In terms of a nine, they, on the other hand, their anxiety is like, will I be late posting this? You know, will I be able to squeeze enough juice out of this? So they're anxious about being late on the ball. So, but in terms of a one, they have rarely any anxieties. Their anxieties might be in the fact that, ooh, I might get noticed for this and I don't have time to do all that explanation. I just want to focus on loving you, right? So they might, that's the only reason that they might be anxious. But anxiety, you know, in all kind of systems where you want someone to convert, in e-commerce, for example, there's this thing called scent, where uh, if you remove a graphical item or a visible item, uh, that you've had in a banner. Let's say you had a price in a banner and that price was situated on a red dot. If that red dot does not exist on the landing page, people start getting confused. They start getting scared that this is not the same offer. Although the price is the same, they don't see the red dot and the red dot was what made them click. And so now they start, Ooh, now it's difficult. And if that red dot doesn't exist on the checkout page, even worse or if they have to count themselves to deduct the discount, horrible. They get super scared and they're outie, right? They're just leaving. And so thinking about anxiety is understanding whatever it is that makes me scared or confused or things like that that is attached to my feelings. You know, I don't wanna look like a fool, so I'd rather not do than to do and look like a fool. That's all I have to say about anxiety for now.